I won't let you down, Marvin. I gotta go back. Please let me go back. No way. I wasn't done exploring. Well, there were rooms and keys that we didn't get, so surely we'll be finding our way back at one point or another. Nice little model here we have in the police department, the museum. Oh, come on, I would totally take that hat. All right, new chapter. Looks like there's only one puzzle to solve. Seriously though, the last place I'd want to be is underground. Definitely the place I'd want to be. Okay, good news. We only have one way to go. Let's go ahead and head back up the stairs. I can only guess how many puzzles are going to be down here. Ooh, you know what? I bet I can squeeze through that. Bullets. Uh, a grenade. Is he that strong? No, no, no. <laughs> More bullets. Perfect. I'm glad I didn't use all the gunpowder to make just handgun bullets. Dude, you can run faster than this. You have to be, like, terrified. <gasps> I thought it would at least phase him. Man, it just takes some serious firepower. Okay, how do I use the grenade? Equip. Nope, nope, nope. Go, go, go. Oh my gosh. Stop your jogging, bro. Seriously. I can't outrun this guy. I feel like he's got a swing to give me any chance of dropping this grenade. There we go. I only had the one. No choice. Gotta take it down. 
I'm just about to run out of ammo. Oh my, that couldn't have been any closer. Man, this is uncomfortable. Nope, I got stuck. <laughs> okay, good, good. I'm so glad that I was able to squeeze around him. Because he's a big idiot. Well, that's not good. There's gotta be something like propane tanks or something. Damn. Where is he? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. First aid. I did not come prepared. Bastard. Oh, no. oh, first aid. Oh my gosh, this pistol is not going to do it. Just keep going, just keep going, bro. There was no way I was getting out of that. I think there was also a red herb, and I kind of lucked out on it. He's gonna do that same thing he did last time. Just drop out of nowhere. You got a knife. Oh man, I feel like he's he's already up there maybe? Okay, good, he's still there. Just give it up, man. It's like this fight is meant to deploy my enemy. Fight this if you run out of ammo. Oh my gosh, I think this is it. I think he got me. Almost. Almost got me. I gotta get my name back. Somebody's watching me. Man, these fights are uncomfortable. This is not like Resident Evil 2 back in the day. It's better. You know what? I think I did forget to mention this as well. Back in the day, you could beat this game in like two to four hours top. So I'm wondering, you know, how long did they drag it out? And I'm hoping for like at least 15 hours. All right, let's go ahead and just kind of move on from this point. I want to get the hell out of here. I think I could withstand at least one more fight before I have to uh, use my herbs. More in? 
inventory space. Perfect. Love it. There we go. Right, right. Just want to make sure I'm not missing anything. just to get to the parking garage. Damn, bro, there had to have been another way to get here. <sighs> Eerie. Oh, that's right, I gotta keep an eye out for liquids. <clears throat> Nothing? No ammunition, no guns, no accessories or attachments <sighs> or bulletproof vests. Nothing. Wow, that's disappointing. <sighs> Damn. Need a key card. You gotta be kidding me. Get off of me! Who is that? Stay sharp. Aww. Lower it. FBI. Sorry. Thank you. For your help. Surprised you made it this far. FBI, huh? What's going on here? Sorry, that information's classified. Where are you going? Do yourself a favor. Stop asking questions and get the hell out of here. Hey! I'm not done talking to you! You know what? When we were fighting the dog, first thought is this. I would have a machete. Oh, now I can go anywhere I want. Let me go back and check that door she went through. I'm not so sure it's a smart idea to have a prison right next to the parking garage. Ugh. The kennel. Oh snap. The morgue, the generator, and the fire engine. Okay, so it's not very big. Exactly. They don't know how to open doors? Dude. 
sure, let's check it out. <laughs> Why not? What do we got to lose? Son of a bitch. <sighs> I'm starting to think that you can't get into any of these. <laughs> But it would be perfect to have a grenade. <sighs> right, right. I'm just gonna unlock everything all at once. Mm, I'll check it out in a minute. Believe it, a real human. <laughs> Hello, human. You've been here long? Long enough. Are we the last ones alive? No, no, there's a few of us. Huh. That's good news, I guess. Yeah. That's, of course, Irons sent you. Irons? You mean Chief Irons? Is he still around? Who cares? Hopefully he's somebody's dinner by now. What do you mean by that? He's the bastard that locked me in here. I'm sure he had a good reason. He did. I was about to blow the whistle on his dirty ass. I'd have done the same thing to him, I guess. Hey, I'll make you a deal. Unlock this cell and I'll give you this. There's no other way out of that parking garage, believe me. Sorry, I can't do that. I have to talk to the chief first. Look, we're both prisoners in this station. So either we play nice and help each other out, Coming. What? What's coming? Come on. Come on, don't be an asshole. Hey, you need this! Just get me the fuck out of here! Oh my god. Who is that? It's just me. So I can put that thing away. I, I don't even know what happened. It just happened so quick. I told you to get out of here. You wouldn't want to end up like Ben, would you? You knew him? He was an informant. Had information of use to my investigation. So what he said was true? Hey, you can't keep walking away from me. I don't even know your name. I'm Leon Kennedy. Find a way out, Leon. Before it's too late. Then we'll talk. Name's Ada. Well, I guess the deal's on. You know, she's so casual about this. Okay, we found the crank, so when we go back to the police station, at least we'll have a place to use it. Memo. Jail power panel. The power panel is out. Can the person in charge of it please take care of it ASAP? I assume everyone knows, but since the jail's power panel is old as hell, we're gonna need those custom power panel parts no one makes anymore. There should be a few in the generator room. Addendum. I got word that there's only one of those power panel parts in the generator room. The guy that's here to fix the bell in the clock tower should have another. So someone swipe, I mean, ask him nicely for it, please. All right, cool. <sighs> Sorry, Ben. I mean, shit happens, bro. <sighs> so this is where we were. All right, let's do it. No, 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 
that's right, because I have to get the generator parts right. <laughs> Okay, okay, so at this point I gotta go back to the parking garage to go back to the other door. Which I think was what? Where the kettles were? Something like that. So, let's see here. I go back to the parking garage, and I go to this... No, I go to this room, and yes, eventually there's a kennel and some other stuff. Alright. Are you kidding me? They better not have those sneak attacks. <sighs> what room is this? <laughs> is this a bathroom, maybe? Um, doesn't really tell me what room this is. The firing range? If it's attached? Yeah. I bet you we find some ammunition in here. Seriously, we're not just going to pick this up. Seven, four, three, nine. So you know what? This might actually work out when it goes back to the parking garage. Ugh. A message from Mr. Raccoon. Howdy, boys and girls. It's your pal from the Raccoon City Zoo. It's always great to see you. Today, I want to talk about something really important to me. You know my popular Mr. Raccoon toys? Well, I heard some bad kids have been using them for target practice, but that makes me really sad. Good little kids wouldn't be that mean, right? Plus, it's super, super dangerous, so just don't do it. Anyway, see you at the zoo. Mr. Raccoon out. Let's see if I can get over this. Oh, look at that. There's a raccoon. Uh, trophy. Vermin extermination. But I still don't know what it does. Okay, hold on a second. How do I get over there if I can't just hop this or crawl under it? So we got two officers in here. Oh, would you look at that, the diamond. See, again, you gotta go back and forth like through this game constantly. Still fun. No, 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 there's nothing else in here? I could have saved all those bullets. <sighs> oh, shoot. I'm not gonna restart, though. Ooh, 
look at that. We finally found a blue herb. So many dogs. We have a use for it, right off the bat. Perfect. All right, pretty close to the generator room. Of course we're gonna check out the Autopsy record number 53477. Name of deceased, Justin Hansen. Male, Caucasian, 39 years old. Observations, found dead in jail cell bed by staff. Hands are still clenched tight due to rigor mortis, which should be coming to an end. It's highly likely that he died just after lights out. Deceased was a known kleptomaniac, incarcerated multiple times. Incredibly, he would steal even while in jail, though that was consistent with his clinical diagnosis. Okay, let me, um, let me just, <laughs> give me a second. <laughs> After all those bullets, I'd rather just not even deal with a critical shot. <clears throat> Please don't let there be anybody else. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no, no, okay, so it opens as I pull. I gotcha. Nothing? Diamond key. There's no way that I'm gonna trust this room picking that up. I have to pull him out all the way before I can get it. Stupid. Yeah, that's what I thought. Part of me wanted to just run out of the room, and the other part thought, well, if he 
pushes me out of the room, and then the dogs get out of the cages, I'm gonna be sandwiched, which sounds horrible. I don't think there was a reason to be in the room with the dogs, so let me check the map just to make sure. Yeah, it doesn't see it doesn't appear to have anything useful in this room, so I'm just gonna just gonna keep going. This must be what is needed to open up the jail cells. In which case, I basically don't have any more ammunition, so this is just not going to work out for me. I'm willing to bet that I have to get in the red area. And there you go, the dogs are out. I'm not dealing with this. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I don't have a big life pool. I gotta get out of this place. Luckily, I have time to look at the map. Alright, so I gotta go left, and I gotta go through the kennel area. Come on, bro. Conserve your ammo. Wow, you see that? Right over his shoulder, there's a dog. I think he's gonna get me. Nope. Come on, you got this. No, no. Oh my gosh. It's just a flesh wound. All right, we gotta go straight. We gotta take a right, and then we gotta take a left to get out of this place. Uh, you know what? Let me go ahead and heal up real quick. I don't want to deal with this again. I don't think they can open doors. Right? Right? Nope. Nope. They can't open doors. Perfect. Oh my gosh. You see this right now. There's nothing I can do about this. Man. Oh my gosh. There's only one chest. Bring it. Do it. Do it. What are you gonna do, bro? Gotcha. Oh, he's too quick. I'm so glad we made extra shotgun shells. Damn. Alright, so apparently there's uh 
there's a trunk out here that I have to find to be able to use this key. Wait, wait, wait. What was the, uh... Let's see here. Let's go ahead and examine this. 7439. Yeah, I don't know. I, I only seem to have found one car with any numbers on it that weren't 911, and it was this one. This sucks. Okay, let's go check it out. still there just waiting for me so I have to go straight and then I have to hook a left here we go <laughs> see I knew it was a bad idea I didn't even face it Get out of the way. don't come in here So we do have film. Because not only are we trying to survive, but we also have a case to solve. Stupid. <laughs> Alright, bro. Let's get out of this place. You know what? Maybe it was a good idea that we did kill him. Because if they were walking around and creeping around through here after the dogs chased us in, that may have been a really bad situation. Okay. So we gotta go ahead and bounce out, we gotta take a right turn, and yeah, I believe for the most part this place is pretty good. I don't know why the morgue is still red. I'd hate to think that I left something behind, something important. I don't know. Here we go. No, they're here. They're already here, man. Awesome. Uh, you know what? If I... There's actually a stairwell. Yes. All right, so apparently this is a new place. I think we're good. Oh my gosh, the nostalgia. I do remember this. Alrighty, let's go ahead and travel to... Oh geez, what was it? What do I got? The inventory. So I have to travel over to the west to develop the film, and I have to travel upstairs on the east to be able to use the crank. There's also a diamond key somewhere on the map. I'm sure it's, I'm sure it's somewhere in here. Um, wasn't there? Let's check both floors. Ah, there we go. The linen room for the diamond. Um, the third floor... <laughs> you know what? There's, there's always so much to do. Gosh, oh my gosh, no, 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 I got the wood, right? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. But that's the only wood I got. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I already used all the wood. Oh my gosh, I think that might be it. All right, not quite. Oh my goodness. I don't have enough of anything to be able to get through this, in my opinion. And missing is not helping. Son of a bitch. Please be dead. And 
there's another one. Dummy. Oh my gosh. Dude, just stay down. I gotta make some bullets. This is ridiculous. <laughs> He's moving around so quick. This dude. I cannot believe how depleted I am on ammunition. As I was saying, I have a role of film to develop. I gotta check on Marvin. This door has been open the whole time. I'm sure they just kind of came in and took Marvin with him. Marvin, where you at, buddy? There you go. <coughs> Oh my gosh, he's dead. Marvin. Oh no. Damn it. <laughs> Looks like there's gonna be a new employee of the month. <laughs> oh shit. Marvin has not given up the fight. Give me back my knife. I'll stop this, Lieutenant. I promise. All right. Let me get uh, let me get a pick me up here. Okay. So where do I have to go to get to the film? Where do I have to go to get to the film? All right. Gotcha. Wait. Yeah. Yes. <sighs> Wait. Yes. <laughs> okay. Are you shitting me?
You know what? I will take some Megan bullets. Even if I have not yet acquired the gun. We have to go and check out the diamond room on the second floor. Which will be right around the corner. Awesome. I'm actually pretty excited to see what's in this one. Alright, let's see if we can crack the code. So, counterclockwise. Okay, okay, that one's one. One, two, three, four, five, no, one, Two, no, no, no. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ding. One, no, 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 that wasn't right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There we go. We cracked it. Let's see what we got. Something sweet, hopefully. Mmm. We're not necessarily going to backtrack, but we are definitely going to go get that little fanny pack. All right, moment of truth. Boom. We need two, zero, three. That was a pain in the ass to get, so I'm hoping we get something useful outside of the fanny pack as well. So two, zero, three, and one, zero, three. Two zero three and one zero love having the inventory space. Now that we solved that little puzzle, I have to think about what we have to do. I think, yeah, we have to use the crank over on the east side. Let me go ahead and check out the map again. Uh, we have a heart and a club's key that we just, we don't have access, not a big deal. Um, a locked door. Like where the helicopter came in, so I'm pretty sure it's on the second floor. Star's office. We've already been there. We don't have access to the PC to be able to get the Magnum. Not a big deal. It's usually kind of an end game thing. We, so we go through the waiting room where there is also a safe. And over here is where we put the crank in. Yep, there it is. Uh, the crank handle. Perfect. And we can't escape this way because the helicopter. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and check this out then. This looks like a very comfortable lounge area. Just let me use a knife. <laughs> what do you guys think? Should I go up or down? They're both pretty ominous. I'm gonna go up. I know exactly what I'm going to do with the wood. I have a perfect place for it.
I don't know about this. Okay, yeah, we'll go down. We'll check this out. Another bad idea, Justin. So this is what the other side looks like. Honestly, I don't know why they let you come here because you can't do anything. There's not even a puzzle to solve. No worries. I mean, we picked up a red herb. And that's the thing, too. When you read the description, it said that it increased your constitution, which we know is your life, uh, your vitality. But does it increase it, like, perpetually? Like, the maximum? Or does it just replenish your life? You know what? I think we figured this out. We gotta put the fire out. But there's only one way to go. Okay, we gotta be able to respond on the fly. Knife is completely gone now. What a shame. Oh, you know what? That's right. We did have another knife. Perfect. <laughs> uh, okay, so we have two pipe systems for the water. I'll check that out in just a minute, though. Key. Excuse me. I don't like this. 
<laughs> what is that dude in a trench coat? Are you serious? So this is the guy that ended up killing Ben. This is why I can't think straight. Let me look at the map. I got the club's key. That's cool. I guess that's where we're going then. Can he open doors? Yeah, he can open doors. got some distance. Good. Nope, nope, nope. Oh my gosh. I'm running it. I'm not dealing with this. I can't be haunted by, by two different things. Oh my gosh. We saw him in the video. There's no safe place in here. I can't get out of here. I'm pinned. There he is. Alright, give me a second to break this down. So, there's a liquor out here. I'm being hunted. Apparently there was a grenade. I completely bypassed it. You know what? Let's see if I can get it. Alright, keep going, keep going. Zigzag. Isn't that what they say when a crocodile is chasing you? Run left and right, zigzag. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. He's either climbing up or he can't go up the stairs. I don't have a first aid spray, so I'm kind of boned. Hmm, what do I do, what do I do? Wow, this is really a long-winded way to be able to get to where I'm going. Is there any place that I can hide? No. <laughs> Come on, Leon. Don't give up, man. You made it to the library. See if we can move this over and get someplace safe. Come on, come on, dude. He's basically on his deathbed. Oh no. He opened the door. Somebody opened the door. Oh shit. Come on. Come on. Where is he? How does he know where I am? None of this is consoling me whatsoever. No! <laughs> no, I think he got me. He got me. Good. Whatever, dude. And we're there. Okay. Like, 
nobody likes being chased. Oh shit! Do I have enough time? Be able to... uh, forget it. Let's let's see if we can get away with it. I was so startled. Playing this game with you guys ain't doing it. And he's still following me. Let me check the map. Okay, there's a door at the end. There are so many ways to go. Wait, no. Last time I went upstairs, that was my big issue, right? So I go to the basement now. There's no safe place to go. Already found a zombie. He's pinning me down in the basement. He's gonna break the glass. Just you wait. Couldn't have been bullets. Nope. Had to be powder. Uh, good news. We found out what to do with the club key. Oh, that does not look like a good way to die. Ooh. Uh, we do have shotgun shells, right? Load, 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 load. We do have the gem to this. Check it out later. <sighs> I don't know if he can get in here. Reflections. That's so cool. Okay, so I am in a safe room. Yeah, just keep walking, bitch. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Once I get up the stairs, what's my plan? Okay, so I have to find a safe room, and I have to be able to get my storage to get the gem, to put it in the box, to, to get whatever's in the little box, and then we'll probably go from there, something like that. Okay, let's go. Okay, we have to get to the safe before he gets me. We got it. Be something sweet. Am I missing something? Oh wait, no. <laughs> I was looking for the box. Dude. Star's badge. Yeah, I'm sure there's more to this than that. A USB. Okay, so we get to go to the PC in the uh, star's office, which is to the west. What is it on the first floor? I think it's on the second floor. Hopefully this is a safe room. I can't imagine him sneaking up on me in this place. The liquors didn't even come in here, so I guess we'll find out. Awesome. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. Lightning Hawk. Ooh, 
Letter to stars, members. To my bestest stars buds, how are y'all doing in that drab old station, hanging in there against old irons? Me, I just got back from a date with a hot chick. Bet you can guess what we got up to under her extra large umbrella. Europe is amazing. One month is in no way enough to even scratch the surface. Maybe I'll extend my vacation for another six months. Barry, don't even think of coming to join me. Wouldn't want to make all the cute girls cry, yeah? So you just leave the babes to me. Jill, if Claire tries to contact you, please let her know I'm okay. Chris Redfield, August 29. So when I get out of here, I have to make a left. I have to go through the library. Gotcha. I don't think I'm being hunted right now. You guys have no idea what a relief that is. I know there's another zombie. There he is. Sneaking around the corner. Sneaky bee. You see that frame rate at this distance? Ah, I can't see his face. I remember doing something like this. So we need to find a gear in this giant place. Repair plan. Location, police station, west side clock tower. Due to the high cultural value of the bell, I'm calling a specialist in to make the repairs. We'll go over the details once they're on the scene, but in the meantime, I'll take steps to secure the bell since the yoke is threatening to break. Oh, there's stuff up there. How do I break it down? So I need to find multiple gears. Man, it would really suck to be pinned. Where am I on the map? Ooh, look at that. Okay, so I did not find a gear. I didn't learn about where to go. That makes me a little bit nervous because traversing the map can be pretty confusing. Man, it is so dark up in this place. Where they get you. Just stay on the ground. Whatever.
Can he get through the door? I think he got through the door. That's probably for the best. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? What the F? The whole time? Oh my goodness, this is not looking good. Forget this, man. And look at that, we found a gear. Wow, that actually takes up two slots, damn. Oh, he's, he's just about to take a swing at me. Damn it. How do I get out of this place? Do I want to go to the balcony? Probably not. I have to be able to kite and get around him so that I can go put the gear back in the clock tower. But can I? And there's a couple of zombies up there too, which, which, <laughs> my gosh, I have to go around. All right, you guys. Where are those zombies at? They got the best of me. They're not even there. Safe place? Please let it be a safe place. I think it is a safe place. <sighs> Relief. That's what I'm telling you. Okay, so you don't actually get pinned to this area. <sighs> it's a way to get to the bell. <sighs> a small gear? A gear that we possibly need downstairs? What? Maybe. That's a disappointment. I'm so close, I could put my arm through the bars. What's that? Oh, for a second I thought we needed the bowl cutters. Maybe we can use it here. Well, no, don't examine it. That's supposed to do. Okay, cool. So I didn't I never had to leave the room. That's awesome. in the box. Oh, we need that for the prison. Hope I don't have to write a report on this. Shut up, Leon. Oh. <sighs> 
Oh no, the dogs. I forgot about the dogs. Maybe now I can get into the police squad car? Nope. Where is it? Where is that box? I don't have bullets for this. You are gonna have problems, like for real. I do have a grenade though that I put away in storage. Oh boy. What have I done? You know what, there's a broom right here. I'm willing to bet you any amount of money that I can go ahead and stick this through and be able to get his ID from the parking garage. Okay, so what am I supposed to... Oh, this is like the pipe game. Like back in the 90s, there was a pipe game with a... You know what, forget it. Let's go ahead and try to figure out how to make connections. I think I have to connect them all at the same time. Ben, buddy, hey. Thank you. Ah. Uh. Huh? Yeah, but that doesn't explain the rumors about the orphanage. I, I just find it way too coincidental Umbrella is one of the benefactors. You told me this interview was about the new scholarship Umbrella set up. <laughs> Come on, Lynette. Nobody cares about that. They want to know about the G-Virus. Where did you hear about this? And a big fucking sinkhole in the city, which, by the way, rumor has it goes straight to your underground lab. Now, are you going to talk to me, or are you going to... This interview is over. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> there we go. It's all about the parking permit. Hmm. What are they after? What's by the toilet? Ben's memo. The station swarming with monsters. Even here, I can hear their cries. But it's not the zombies I'm afraid of. Codename? Tyrant. The ultimate bioweapon developed by those bastards in the utmost secrecy. To think that that thing might be wandering around here. Chances are they've ordered it to wipe out the witnesses. Ugh. That's not good. Nope, that's not good at all. Um, let me think. That's right, I did not bring my grenade. I'll have to come back. <sighs> Give me a break. I really tried to dodge him, regardless of how that looked like. Leon's just too fucking slow. <laughs> Dude sucker punched me to death. Damn it. That's not good. <sighs> Give me a oh my gosh. <laughs> that was really close. Everything has been so close and uncomfortable for me. I can make it! I'm mostly surprised that I made it. Saving your ass, that's twice. I didn't realize you were keeping score. Look, this isn't a game. Oh, you gotta kill me. Nothing.
something dies down here. Take it, you have the key card. Yeah, and this. I was hoping you could explain what's on it. Maybe. After I hear it. Let's get out of here. I'm ready to go yet. We might want to open the shutter. Man, I really don't want to miss the opportunity to get something out of the trunk of one of these squad cars. Is there really nothing... Oh, that's right, I don't have the key with me. Hmm. I do want to go back and check this out. No, we definitely want this one to be equipped. Why is the door locked? I turn the power on and everything. So stupid. Ada, where you at, girl? Open the damn shutter already. Yeah, yeah, I'm getting there. Is that the intel you needed? Unfortunately, no. Ben didn't come through. Well, what exactly are you looking for? More info on the people responsible for this mess. What about you? <sighs> Trying to save the world? I told Lieutenant Brenna I'd bring help. Good luck getting that. <sighs> Roads out. Going through that gun shop looks like the only way. Right. No, I don't... I, <laughs> I don't even know what I'm looking at. What a mess. Well, yeah, it's a mess. After all this shit. took up more space than I expected. Letter to the shopkeeper. Kendo, it seems like you've got your reasons for staying put, so I'll trust you to take care of yourself. Still, if things get worse and your other arrangements don't work out, you know where to find me. I'll do everything I can. Jill Valentine. Hurt you. I said don't move. I'm just passing through. I'm gonna ask you to lower that weapon. I kill you are. You're gonna turn around and go right back out the way you came in. I think your daughter needs help, sir. Don't tell me how to deal with my daughter. 
Drop it. No! Wait! Step aside. We need to terminate her before she turns. Terminate? It's my fucking daughter. Ada. Just let them be. Emma? Sweetheart, I told you to stay put. Daddy? They did to us. You're a cop. You're supposed to know something. How did this happen? Huh? She was a sweet little angel. Mommy. I'm sleeping, honey. Okay. And I'm gonna put you to bed too, okay? Emma. Just go. Just give us some privacy. It's one thing to keep the truth from me, but why him? I want to find out what's happening here and stop whoever's behind it. Helping people like them? That's why I joined the force. My mission is to take down Umbrella's entire operation. May not make it out. Whatever it takes to save this city, count me in. Let me just hold this shotgun for a second. I just want to see if it felt any different. You know, he does have a shotgun. You could definitely use that shotgun. Heard of the Umbrella Corporation? They're a pharmaceutical company secretly making bioweapons. They have a virus. It turns people into indestructible monsters. That explains the horrible things I've seen. And that's why I'm looking for Annette Birkin. She's the one at Umbrella responsible for unleashing the virus. I'm going to bring her down. This is how we get to Annette. Based on what you've said, the sewer seems fitting. Well said. After you. Gee, thanks.